Good morning, guys. I've literally woken up. It's my day off. It is currently 20 past eight. I've just gotten changed. I'm literally in the worst outfit. I've got my black coat and joggers, a random black hoodie, but I'm currently going out to take my washing to go and wash because last week it was such a faff doing it like midday. So kind of hoping that no one's up yet on Saturday and I'm doing their washing. So I'm gonna go down there, have a look and hopefully get my washing in the washing machine before anyone else does good morning guys I feel like i can now restart the vlog feeling a little bit more alive in a little bit I haven't had my coffee yet i'm about to start drinking it just spill it all over my dance bag though like it's not been a good morning well it's not been a good morning but i obviously went downstairs to put on my wash happy that i did because there was like no one in well there was no one in there it was empty i've set time for 40 minutes and i've only got 25 left because i was obviously do my coffee and then cleaning it up from my dance bag so not only did i drop my coffee in my dance bag i then actually hit my head on the shelf which made me drop my coffee on my dance bag and then when i was in the uh the laundrette area a tumble dryer <laughs> door hit me on the head as well i mean it wasn't hard I'm like, do I have a headache because I'm tired and I've just woken up? Or do I have a headache because I've just been hit in the head twice? So it's currently Saturday, 20 to 9. And I've got a plan of things that I need to do today. The most important thing that I need to do is I need to go back to the bank, which is so annoying. In France, it's just not like the UK with bank accounts. Obviously, in the UK, when you have a bank account, you can literally like do it online. And then they just post you everything, like post your card. But in France, you have to go into the bank, have an appointment, and then they open up the bank account for you, send you some information, then you actually have to physically go pick up the card again, which I just think is a bit strange. I mean, maybe it's more secure that way. I'm not too sure. But they are closed on Sunday and Mondays, and I've only got a Saturday, Sunday off this weekend, so I need to go in today. But anyway, I've got 20 minutes before my washing is done, and then I can go down, put it in the dryer, come up, and maybe have some breakfast. I'm not too sure. I'm just... Just have my I'm focusing on my coffee, I've got a headache. Um just gonna chillax for a bit. So I'm currently ready to go out. I've had such a mess of washing this morning, like obviously got up so early, put it all on, and then went back down, put it into the dryer, and it was still wet when I went back down again. So I put it into the dryer again, and it, again, it was just wet. So my flat currently looks like this. <laughs> and my bathroom, I've got all of like my leggings hung on the door because I think that they'll dry quicker than trying to put them through the dryer again. I mean, luckily the dryers are free and I didn't have to pay for it twice. And it's just like the actual washing machines that you have to pay for. But yeah, really, really annoying. But anyway, we're on our way out. This is the uh, OOTD. I mean, I'm not a fan of the skinny jeans or the Converse, but I kind of like don't have any other choices because my blue jeans that I wanted to wear are wet. I've just gotten home with my massive bag. Do you know what? When I get back home and I get another car, I'm never going to take my car for granted again because I miss having a car so much. I sh I'm so furry from my scarf. It literally... This is the cutest scarf from Primark, but it molts a lot. I'm actually going to turn on my radiators because I'm cold and we're trying to dry some clothes. However, I'm going to give you guys a haul of everything that I got. I I didn't want to spend money. You know, I went to the shops. God, I've been dragged through a hedge backwards. I went to the shops purely to go to the bank and pick up my bank card. And I just... I went into Primark and the spending started. So, um, I'm probably actually gonna start off with Ocean, which is like the big supermarket here because I've got it to hand. So first thing I got, it might be a little bit long. I got a radiator era thing. Why are clothes air is so expensive? I was gonna bring one from home, like buy one at home and it was expensive there. And I, I don't know, maybe I thought that it'd be cheaper in France, but they're literally like 20 euros. And I just can't believe that a bit of metal that you use to hang clothes up is that expensive. So I bought this one for three euros and you just put it on. I mean, I should probably figure out how to, uh, how to do it. I think that this is a little bit big for what I want it for. 
because my radiator is already small. But let's give it a go. This radiator here is the biggest radiator that I have in my place. Um, do you know what that will do? It's not the most secure, and obviously it's meant to go on like a thick, oh, <laughs> it's meant to go on a thick radiator. But I think, oh gosh. I think that will do for now. Like, I can just put, like, socks on, you know? Ta-da. I also don't know what this is from. This, like, mark on the radiator. I assume someone put something against it and it burnt. But it was not me. Just so you guys know. But anyway, continuing on with the ocean haul, I will continue putting things on my VTEC era in a little bit. But I got a big... Thing of strawberries. I then got a head of broccoli, some tzatziki and some hummus. I then picked up some shampoo and conditioner. Now, I don't want to complain about living in Paris because you know what a life to be living, but shampoo and conditioner, firstly expensive and secondly, why can't I find Tresemme? Maybe, I don't, I don't know where it actually comes from. I just kind of assume that you could get anything anywhere. Maybe that's a little bit, what's the word? Not oblivious, obnoxious. I'm not too sure of me, but they also only do shampoo. Like, shampoo is, like, the main thing that they sell. I and mean, conditioner is very hard to come by. And I can only find two little ones. So, that's what I got. Next up, I got some green beans. Because I saw a really cool air fryer recipe using... Huh, that's not parmesan. I really thought I had it just then. I gave parmesan in here. I don't know where it is. Oh, here it is. But I saw an air fry recipe on TikTok using green beans and parmesan. So I got both of those. I then got one red pepper because I don't need a pack of three because it will be wasteful of me. I then picked up two packs of my favourite cheddar. Kind of like the only cheddar that I can get here. They did have blocks and it was like of orange cheddar, not a bit of me. But they were literally like this thin. Like they were really small and it was like six euros. So these I think are about, I'm not actually too sure, maybe like two... What's this? I don't know what that is. Um, I think they're like two euros each, so I've got two packs. I then got some baby carrots to go with my hummus, some cling film. I picked up some command hooks. But now that I've got these, I can put on my other little mirror. So I'm gonna do that today. Um, anything else from Ocean? Oh yes. <laughs> My dry kind of <laughs> that I showed you guys. And then the final thing I got was this Airwick spray. It's for the automatic thing I have in my bathroom. But I thought I'd pick one up just so I have it. But anyway, moving on to Primark. I picked up this pack of little bralettes. These are honestly my favourite bralettes to wear ever. I get them in a size small. And they were €13 Euros for three. And I haven't seen this blue colour. I already have these two colours. But I thought this colour was cute. So I got a whole new pack because I literally wear them every day. And then I got a new bath mat. This was nine euros and it was definitely not a need but a want. How cute. It says sweet cheeks on it. I just think it was the cutest thing ever. So I picked it up. Definitely did not need it and could have saved myself some money but what can you do? I then got even more storage baskets because I'm a girl who likes storage. So I bought these to go underneath my sink. If you guys watched the last vlog, I had a bit of an issue. I bought these. You can't, my arm's in the way. Those for underneath my sink. But obviously the sink has a pipe going underneath it, so I couldn't fit them in. So I thought buying slimmer ones, I can put one on each side of the pipes. And then I also picked up this little pack of baskets because for some reason our bedside tables don't have drawers. And I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of inconvenient and you just end up making your bedside table messy. So I bought this pack of three. I mean, I don't really need these two in the middle. I will put them somewhere, but I'm not gonna leave them in here. But I just thought this would be a nice basket just to go underneath my uh, bedside table. And then I can put lots of bits and bobs in here and keep everything a little bit tidier. But I actually, do you know what? All I wanted was a lamp, command strips, <laughs> and a fake plant. And I didn't... I got one thing, I got the command strips, but I didn't get anything else, so I'm basically a spender, is what I'm trying to say, I always find a way to spend money, which is not good, and I'm on a spending ban now, like, I, the money has gone down, <laughs> I need to start being a little bit careful, but I don't actually know what I'm going to do for the rest of the day, I think it's like 3.30 now or something, I was going to go to the Disney Village with my friend Izzy, but she's been working today, and I thought she might be a little bit too tired to go out after, and I don't blame her. And if I'm being honest, can I be bothered to get changed into trackies now, chill, warm up, and then go back out? Probably not, so I think she was only really going just to get me out of the house, but I have been out, and I don't think I said, but did I say? I can't remember. 
but Reese, another guy from our cast, ended up going to the shopping centre as well. So we had a lovely trip out. I need to tidy up my room, my apartment, my bathroom, my everything. So I'm going to go do that. I also need to actually figure out what I'm going to have for dinner. Um, oh, jacket potato. I found baked beans. Oh my god, yesterday we went to the shops and we found Heinz baked beans. And it generally made me so happy. So I'm going to have a jacket potato, beans and cheese for dinner. And I cannot wait. <music> Oh my goodness oh we're blurry that's useful i feel like i have been busy but also like don't know what i've been doing but it's currently quarter to six i thought it was gonna be like oh no my phone just fell i thought it was gonna be like 10 past five or something I mean, it's only like 35 minutes but it's basically six o'clock here so i probably should think about having some dinner when i got home i was so hungry i was just snacking on crisps but I've literally just been like sorting out my apartment and I feel like I did this exact same thing last weekend but I feel like last weekend I was a little bit rushed like I got home late well I guess it was only on Monday that I did it but I got home late and I was a bit frazzled but I feel like now I've properly sorted things out my little mirrors on my wall it's looking very cute so I'll give you guys a little overview of what I've done but firstly I'm actually gonna put a jacket potato on I'm gonna try it in the air fryer so i think i basically just do it how i would normally at home so i've got a potato here larger potatoes in france are hard to find <laughs> like they always just sell smaller ones but yes so when i went shopping they had two big ones and i got both of them so sorry if anyone else wanted them so at home normally just like stab the potato to let the air out i think i don't know my mum tells me to do this so i do it and then normally I'll wrap it up in kitchen roll and put it in the microwave for like eight minutes. But I don't have any kitchen roll. And I actually don't know why we do that. So I'm just gonna put it in the microwave for eight minutes. I also am debating whether I should buy kitchen roll or not. I do have the space to store it. Like I have this space here that I could just put overfill of kitchen roll in. But you literally have to buy like three rolls or like one massive roll. <laughs> so I need to decide what I'm gonna do about that. But the jacket potato is on, so let me show you guys what changes i've made to the flat obviously it just shows you this section here so i've just put a nice basket here and my clothes area is there it didn't really work i ended up just taking off the like handles and then just standing it here just so i could hang things up i mean this radiator dries things really quick so it's all right but didn't work how i wanted it to but yes yeah, so in here i just have some overspilled chocolate milk and basically all my like reusable bags tea towel some cleaning cloths so that's kind of just what's in that bag, which I, it looks a little bit empty, but it's a lot tidier than what it was. And then on the table, I just put one of these little baskets. I kind of need it to uh, puff out a little bit there, but I've literally just put like my card holder. It's basically like a dumping basket for the things that I use every day, like my ID, bus pass, keys, and just all that stuff. So it'll basically be empty every day, but I take things out and you know, it's just nice and safe there and then i don't think oh no this has changed over here so this is the little basket that i have put underneath my bedside table i've just put this in there and obviously if i have anything else on here i can just put it in there now and then i guess this is kind of what has changed the most so i originally had these two pink baskets down here at the back but i've now got all four of these here and everything is very very organized and then obviously the third basket <laughs> is now over there but i much prefer it like this like it just looks so much neater and then up here i just have like my curlers i think like electronics and then extra bits and bobs spare towel spare bath mat just all up here however my under the sink area i don't think is ever going to look neat i like this down here this up here is a little bit messy but i just feel like there's not much i can actually do so in this one i just have all my hair stuff all my fake tan sanitary products first aid kit um this is just whatever honestly bits and bobs spare clips and hair bands and then this is just all of my makeup spare stuff down there like honestly it is a mess but it's gonna have to do but i will update you guys on the potato front 
in a, like five minutes and hopefully it doesn't explode. <laughs> Completely forgot to show you guys, not a potato update. But I put up my little mirror. I just sat down on my bed and I was like, oh my god, I didn't show you guys. I think that this may actually be my most favourite dinner today. So I've had the potato in the air fryer. Don't know if you guys will even be able to actually see it. This is what it's currently looking like. I think it's ready. I'm not too sure. I don't eat the skin of the potato. So for me, like, if the skin's crispy, it is crispy. But it's more so if the actual potato is cooked. Also, I have these reusable little inserts i mean i probably will still wash mm, i don't know if i actually use washing it's only a potato maybe i'll be a bit lazy but i've also got my beans ready they've been in the microwave and then <laughs> i've just spent a while here oh no chopping up some cheese because obviously i don't have like blocks of cheese or grated cheese um so oh it's soft right i'm literally gonna have the best evening oh stunning so then you've got to do a little bit of cheese i feel like i need a lot more cheese but i literally cannot be bothered to sit here and cut more cheese but now we put on the beans oh wow this was a good idea the air fryer is unbeatable i've literally been telling everyone like oh my god you need an air fryer like it changes your life but this is what my dinner is looking like obviously we'll wash that up after gonna put this here we'll only need a fork so less washing. I'm also currently watching Mile Higher. So I'm just going to eat my dinner, watch some Mile Higher, and then wait for Aiden to get home. Although, what is the time here? It is currently 6.20. You probably won't be home for like, maybe like well over an hour. I look like I've just woken up from a nap. I promise. I have not been napping. I've actually just been on FaceTime to eight. Look at... I really thought coming to Paris, I would be like that girl do you know what i mean like looking cute and no it's, it's just not me you know like i wish it was and i've just been on pinterest i haven't been on pinterest in so long no i've seen all these like cute outfits that i looked on asos and i was finding loads of stuff that i liked and i'm just not gonna order it because i just don't have the funds to be doing that however i have basically just spent my whole evening on facetime to age and i still am i was like i'm gonna go quickly because i want to go talk to my friends and take off my makeup so that is what we are about to do i always keep my makeup stuff in the shower because normally I just take it off in the shower i'm going to take it off right this second as you guys can see i literally match the color of my jumper now but anyway i'm gonna go now because it's definitely starting to get more towards 11 and we need to start going to bed earlier over here so i hope you all did enjoy this video if you did be sure to leave a massive thumbs up comment down below you thought and if you guys aren't already then make sure to subscribe to my channel and i shall see you very soon in a new one bye